Now, when you put the fingernail on, as I said earlier, with my, my nails are fairly arched, and what happens when you press at the tip, like you're supposed to, to have good adhesion at the tip, the rear uh, kicks upward, and when it does that, you get a little bit of rocking motion on the nail. We don't want that. We want it to be secure. Uh, two things you can do. One is to do what I did a while ago where you put two glue dots on, one towards the tip and one towards the rear of the nail. Or what you can do too is take a piece of uh, toothpick and kind of stick it underneath in the gap there between um, your real nail and the fake nail. If I can get it in there. Probably have too big of a piece here. Oh, there we go. Stuff it in there. So I have that toothpick in there, filling that gap. Didn't do it real well. There we are. Stick it in there. And that will keep that from rocking back and forth. Now, that's kind of, um, you know, it does work. I've tried it before. But you don't want to leave it like that. So what you do after that, we've got to talk about transport tape. This is Nexcare Flexible Clear Tape. Again, you can buy it at a pharmacy. Looks like that. What you want to do, regardless whether you have the toothpick in there, I mean, that's immaterial. It doesn't matter if you have a toothpick or not. Um, but you want to cover that gap because what's going to happen if you do a rosqueado, the strings are going to catch at the rear and, and flip that nail off, pull it off very possibly, or at least it's going to get caught for sure. So you take the piece of tape and simply put it on there like that across the rear and then this the string travels smoothly from behind the nail on across the Rico and onto the Rico nail and off you don't get caught you can play really powerfully strongly rascados any kind of strumming and that'll stay on there now the tape is not to hold the nail on there. it has nothing to do with it the glue dot is doing the heavy work of keeping the nail on there. That's just to bridge that gap. And you, know, you just make sure it's flush on there. And then you won't get it. If you use two glue dots or the toothpick, um, and both of those, either way, you've got to use the transport tape probably um, to cover that gap. That nail is not going to rock. It's not going to rock any more than your real nail ever did when you're playing.